It's this week's recommended Blender downloads. Toasty! Let's go. Alright guys, how's it going? I hope you're doing very well. Came to that time of the week again where I scour the internet looking for the best downloads for your downloading pleasure. As always, please support third party developers and artists. Now, I hope you had a very nice Christmas, I hope you had a nice holiday, whatever you may or may not celebrate, I just hope you had a couple of nice days off, let's put it that way. Now I thought it's going to be pretty quiet this week, it's going to be dead, people are going to be busy. My god, I have a lot of content to get through this week and I mean a lot of content. I'm not looking forward to writing down these links, but hey, let's quickly get into it. Now the first thing you have is the Geometry Nodes Trail version 2 and this is from Ben. So you know it's going to be damn good, you know it's going to be sexy. It essentially gives you a nice animated trail and it uses geometry nodes. Now, I said this last week and the week prior, you're going to start to see a lot of geometry nodes. It's not because I'm focusing in on it, it's just you're going to see a lot of this stuff. And we'll quickly find this out in a second. And moving it over to one of our favourites, now there is a translation issue, I think it might be Japanese, Chinese, not entirely sure, but when it comes to add-ons, oh, Mwah! Bon Appetit! Blender add-on Cycle Texture Paint Layers. Essentially, it gives you a nice painting layer system for cycles. Thank you very much. It is available for free. I'll leave all the links in the description down below. And moving over to the Christmas tree geometry nodes. Now, it might be a little bit late in the week for this. Yeah, you might. Stick it in your back pocket. Keep it for next year. This is pretty sexy to be honest. Here's my take on a Christmas tree. It uses geometry nodes. It's available for free. Thank you very much, mate. I do appreciate it. Moving over to Chuck CG, another staple when it comes to downloading assets free for Blender. You have a nice hard surface kit. Some nice materials. Might be able to throw them in the scene somewhere. Definitely worth checking that bad boy out. And moving over to Paul. Now I'm not going to butcher your second name, mate. I do apologise, it's Italian, but you have the Grease Pencil Brush Paint Pack, Drafting Pencils. So if you're into your Grease Pencil, if you're into kind of having that nice drafting look, this is definitely a recommended download. Next one up is from Arthur Shapiro and it's a Blender Animation Space Switcher. Not entirely sure, I've not used this to be honest. Space Switcher is an add-on that gives you the control on amateur pose bones animation no matter what hierarchy they have. Hmm. So, may let you go in and out of the bones and nice and easily. Hey, hey, that's what my wife said. And the next one up, I don't know if it's worth a download. It might be, it might not be. But what I recommend you do is you download it, you save the assets, you put it into the asset browser, and it gives you a nice bunch of kind of basic materials. So, you have metal rust, you have glass, you have wood, stuff like this. Definitely worth, nah, I don't know if definitely worth downloading, but it may just tickle your interest. Now this will be worth downloading and it's a hundred free pack of hair textures. Now when it comes to hair textures, doing things like hair cards, this is definitely worth it. So it essentially generates nice hair using, I would imagine it's alphas. Good for things like Unity, Blender, Vroid, your choice. A hundred pack? What else can you ask for? It's Christmas. Take it, run with it, download it. If you never use it again, Hey, at least you've got it. Now I've covered a few different versions of this and this is the ultimate index viewer. Now viewing the indices inside of geometry nodes, they don't have it, they essentially don't have it and it's fucking stupid when you think about it, right? Something that should be pretty much there. Now you can go into developer mode, you used to be able to enable indices but I think they've removed it for now. So people are coming up with a solution. Again, there's four or five different versions of this. There is a few different guys that make it. I think Sanctus has got one. But here, download it, grab it for yourselves. Now, the next one up is Geometry Nodes Camera Culling. Now, essentially what it does is anything that the camera doesn't see, it essentially makes a billion. Good for saving things when it comes to render times. Now, you need to be careful because obviously ray refraction, stuff like this. But it does save you in terms of render times. If you have the Erendale kit, the ETK kit, I believe, I think it has something very similar. So it's up to you. This is for free. Again, very gracious. And moving over to Slink. Slink has made a pack for Bygen. Now, Bygen is made by Curtis Hall. I would imagine all you do is take these assets, put it in a Bygen, and you get a couple of things. Now, 
the page is a bit shit to be honest it could be doing with a little bit more work but it looks like it's got fireflies icicles and a few other things so yeah definitely worth checking out and moving over to the car traffic library rig cars now you can see here it's 69 dollars but there is a free trial version of traffic q traffic is an ever expanding library of realistic optimized assets for various vehicles so there is a free trial if you want to kind of give it a quick shot take it for a test drive hey 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 on fire tonight definitely worth having a quick swatch and moving over to github we have the bone widget add-on now bone widget is a blender add-on to assist with making custom bone shapes very nice as a library of shapes that make it easy to apply to any rig again it is available for free there is a video that kind of complements it so i'll kind of dive a little bit deeper and just a very quick shout out to Janum. He's made a very nice tool, it is available on Blender Market. You can actually go into GitHub and download it for yourself for free, so it might be worth checking out. And it's essentially a retopology tool slash mess features. Check the video out, I'll leave the link, have a quick swatch at it. It looks pretty damn epic to be honest. And as you can see here, it is available for free if you want to actually download it. And just quickly wrapping things up with our Sketchfab download of the week you have the Renault Alpine A11 O Group nice bunch of cars for you now generally at this point I do commercial add-on of the week but do me a favor guys save your pennies I might have something for you to buy in a couple of weeks hey, hey. show me the money show me the money <laughs> <laughs> and just quickly finishing up, we have Polyhaven, and it's a Studio Small 09. There is a great resource when it comes to HDRI, and PBR of the week is the Dusty Plank Wall. Do me a favour, guys. Like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Follow me on Twitter. You know what to do. Have a happy new year. <laughs>